Princeton 74, Yale 62. Our own Megan O'Brien is with our player of the game. Thanks, John. Leslie, your team comes away with its first yeah, Ivy League yeah. win. You guys, held, uh, you guys held Yale to just six points in that fourth quarter. In your mind, what was the biggest difference in the fourth quarter of play? I think we just dialed in. We, we realized that we really needed this win, and we just came together as a team on defense, and then that led to our offensive scores. And how about your composure playing with four fouls? How did you manage to keep that intensity up without picking up that fifth foul? Yeah, I mean, I just got to stay. I have to stay within myself, and especially in games like this, when the team needs me, I need to, you know, keep that composure and, you know, do everything I can to, to get us a win like this. Now, coming off of yesterday's performance, one where Brown scored 98 points, how did you guys manage to bounce back and come away with a win today? Again, like, we, we knew that we needed this win, and um, we just came together as a team yesterday and today, and we... We, we did everything that we could in order to get this dub today. All right, well, thank you so much. Thanks Enjoy so much. it. Thanks. John. Thanks very much, Megan. A great win for the Tigers. As Megan mentioned, 25-6, the Tigers outscore the Bulldogs in the fourth quarter as they pull down a 12-point win. And they have their first Ivy League victory of the season. It breaks a three-game losing streak in Ivy League play for the Princeton University Tigers. Two weeks off for finals now for the Princeton women. And then we'll be back on Friday, the 1st of February. Dartmouth is in. It's a 7 o'clock tip-off here on the Ivy League Digital Network. So for my broadcast partner, Megan O'Brien, this is John Moses saying good night here on the Ivy League Digital Network.